Hi everyone, and welcome to Jan Plays The Sims Harry Potter Style. In this video, I'll just be doing a short introduction of all the characters I have so far. I have 80 characters of, well, zero at 80, maybe I have more. I think I have more, I think I have like, this is zero out of 80, so zero of them are active. But I've got all the centaurs, I've got house elves, they're not in the world right now because they are NPCs. They're all the maids and ballers. I've got extra staff. I haven't gone through any of these in my videos because they're extras. Nobody knows who they actually are. But I wanted some characters that were kind of mugglish or wizarding that could just be doing whatever. Um, all the professors. I've got all these characters. Oh my goodness. And I don't think that I have missed any, but if I have, please let me know. There's a lot of random muggles that I have in my game as well. Um, but let me know and I will try to and make those characters and add them into my game. I will be going through each of the characters individually in different videos and telling you who I got these characters from because I did not make like any of these characters, maybe like just a couple and all the custom content that goes into my game for each individual family and place. So let me know if there's anybody I missed. I think I have all of the Hogwarts students, all of the families, all of the Death Eaters, all of the other students that I know about, all the ministry workers, all the Order of the Phoenix, and then a lot of random people like all these centaurs for one centaur. So I do like to have a very complete game. So let me know and enjoy looking at all my neighborhoods and all my gameplay. Thanks so much and hope you enjoy tuning in. Bye-bye.